What's going on, everybody? Mike here. Welcome back to Thousand Turbos. Ooh, as you can hear, it's just windy as hell out there. Using the microphone today just because it's super windy. Um, we're going to take a break from uh, working on the shop. I've been uh, setting stuff up in here tables, my banner. I got I know I got to center it. We got the Tahoe in here now, which is awesome. I still got to put the mat back in. I was just getting it centered and figured out. So that, that video is coming of me starting to set up the inside of the shop. So. Well, I figured, well, I'm going to take a break. We're going to head to Watson, Saskatchewan and check out their uh, annual show and shine. So, and like I said, I figured I'd do the intro inside of here because it is rank windy out today. So, as you can see, this, this banner is even blowing and I'm not even out. Like, look. So, and I'm not even outside. I'm fully sheltered and it's blowing. So, <sighs> bear with us. Um, yeah, I apologize for the sound due to the wind. So, I've got my microphone. So if I got to tuck stuff, you know, like, hey, you know, stuff like that, I apologize in advance. So who knows? I might end up having a double bunch of music over it. Anyways, we'll see you in Watson. All right, folks, we are here in Melfort, Saskatchewan to check out the uh, their annual show and shine. I apologize for the wind. It's really bad. I got my microphone kind of tucked in here. So hopefully we don't get too much wind noise. But yeah, it's really windy. So. Let me flip the camera around. We've got some tractors and stuff. There's a really sick Camaro over here that we saw when we were pulling up. So we'll check that out probably on our way out. But uh, yeah, she's really windy. So let's get across the street here. I got Ma and Haley with me. We went to the uh, little show they got going on here in town, this little uh, thrift store, or not thrift store, but like uh, uh, what you would call a, uh, I guess like a convention, anyways. So over there, we got some of their, uh, yeah, I gotta zoom out. There we go. You can see how windy it is. Holy shit. I apologize, guys. I apologize for the wind. We got some stuff there. And who got the tractors here? Let me zoom out. So. There we are. So how are you guys all doing? Hope everyone's doing well. Picked the hell of a day for a car show. It is fucking windy. But it is what it is. A little for a nice, nice slow tour. And again, I apologize for the wind. Hang on a sec, my microphone unclipped. All right, hopefully that's better. Oh, sorry guys, well there's the Camaro. Guess you didn't want to stick around. But anyways, let's flip it around again. There we go. Hopefully the microphone sticks on me this time. I hate these damn clips. All this fucking wind. Alright, there's a bunch of nice old tractors, eh, Haley? Yeah. Which one? This one? The four. That one? Oh, well, there's their museum. We'll go check that out here when we're done. This is, I was saying before, part of what I want to start doing is check, also checking out the small town museums. We got some more stuff over here. And finally, no wind. So, again, I apologize for the sound. My microphone's bugging. So, hopefully it's working. Otherwise, it'll be a bunch of music. So, the nice, nice old Dodge here. I guess old, but it's... You can see what that all says. So she got some stuff done to it. Oh, there we go. Sorry about that, guys. Oh, that big old snail. That's a huge turbo. Damn. You know, we like turbos. Another one. I'm guessing these are uh, like truck pull trucks, which we got some truck pulls and tractor pulls coming up on this, this summer, so we'll be checking that out. I think I remember this one from last year. We got this stuff over here. We'll check that out after the end. Just keep on walking on and checking out the nice the town of Watson. Really, really nice small town. I really like it here. It's about a two hour drive. So we're just going to walk and check it out. Spend as much time here as we can. This is pretty sweet. A little Falcon drag car. 
or Fairlane. That's ah, one of the two. That's sweet though. Look at the flares. SVT Focus. Wagon yet too. Subarus. Some Mustangs. That's nice. Yeah, I don't know if the camera's picking up the sparkle. That's a nice mock one. This is nice too. Yep. We all know how much I like blue. Uh, Haley's doing her stuff at the same time. So, a lot of nice vehicles this year again. If you guys remember what we uh, what was all here last year, comment down below. I'd like to hear it. So, uh, the wind's picking up like crazy. Nice rat rod. You now with these, I always like to take a peek inside them. That's where all the craziness usually is. <laughs> so. This is nice too. Oh yeah. That is gorgeous. The paint, the, the color and the chrome just works so well. This one too. Oh, that is a beautiful truck. Oh, look at the wheels. That is, that is sick. See what the inside looks like. Oh, that's just as nice. Oh, that is nice. Actually, we're going to do that. Oh, it is. Look at this. A Bradley. I don't see too many of these anymore. Look at that bass boat paint on this. I don't know if it's going to pick up on the camera. But she's got the bass boat paint job happening. Neat movements here. here. Well, if you guys know anything about these, comment down below. I'd love to hear what you guys... Yeah, I don't know if it's coming up on camera, but... That is another one of them. It's all sparkly. It's a neat car. Oh, now the sun's going to disappear. Yeah, that is cool. All right, let's uh, see what they got over here. Got a nice bike. Uh, we got a IROC Daytona. Mon, Mon, my mom had one of these in 92. Dodge Daytona. Yeah, it was blue and silver. It was nice. Mm. No, yours wasn't an IROC, no. Yours was a CS, I believe. <laughs> If anyone knows what that is, yeah, he knows what, yeah, better than an IROC. This is the one we had. We had a CS. Reaper 3. Okay, I'm guessing. The, pardon? The lights? Those are spotlights. Moses is asking about the uh, pods. And the spotlights for off road. So, this is nice. Corvette. I like these. These are. Some of my favorite style. Hopefully the microphone's still working for you guys. Yeah, that's a five speed or six speed. So it's like a 56 Ford. Ooh, again. That chrome. Yeah, I know. That chrome with that paint. So oh yeah. Square bodies. Makes me want to get mine out. All three of them. That's a sweet truck. Another Mach 1, I believe, yeah, yeah, it's, this camera does not do the justice with the sunlight, I mean with the, yeah, with the paint, beautiful Chev, I guess it's a 52, got an LS in it, looks like a uh, Gen 4, that's a nice car. Oh, supercharged. Look at that. <laughs> that is cool. Should I do that to the Tahoe instead of a turbo? I could. All it is is a uh, supercharger Haley out of a uh, Grand Prix. 
Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, nice little small so, town, eh? Just yeah. old school. Tahoes and turbos, Not Tahoes and blowers. Yeah. Um, turbo. This is nice old Dodge work yeah, truck. Got another Ford Galaxy or Fairlane. I think it's like a Galaxy 500. I believe. It is. Galaxy 500. We got a Can Am. Yeah, it has I know. These are cool. It's like basically a Skidoo. So if a Skidoo and a motorcycle had a baby, that's what it would look like. Yeah. Like, a little Red Express. No, my mom's cousin Rodney there with the bike has something similar to this. He has a, a has a Warlock. That, he has a little Red Express and a Warlock. Actually, yeah. So we're gonna have to go check those out one of these days. Then last but not least, we got this guy here. So, and then I think we're gonna uh, go probably check out the museum. See what they've got going on in there. So then you guys let me know if you guys think the museum stuff should be separate videos or, you know, or what. But I figure while I'm in the community, I, might, I like to document as much of it as I can, right? The entire community. Uh, you guys can't see because of the glare, but it's it's all classic in there. Thing smells like it was just recently painted. So, all right, guys, we're gonna uh, pop over to the museum, check it out, and then we'll uh, see what's up. I guess. All right, folks, we are at the uh, Melford Canadian. This is like probably one of the first Western like Saskatchewan banks, because Melford is, Watson. or sorry, Watson and Melford as well are both like centrally located. So, yeah, this was like a big community back in the day. So let's, uh, we can start at the top, I guess, and work our way down. I didn't realize there were stairs. Let's go see what's upstairs. So comment down below, guys, if you think I should make this a separate video, like a separate series, or what? Okay, here we are. Guess the top floor of the uh, Watson Museum. There we go. Celebrate the incorporation. Kind of neat. Kind of. Kind of shows you. It was a big, big town. This town has a real special Santa. Yeah, it does actually. I can't. I can't quite remember the connection. Maybe some anybody who watches the video will comment down below, but. Uh, yeah, <laughs> see that toy right there? <laughs> yeah, welcome to Saskatchewan. You couldn't make that toy this nowadays. No siree. <laughs> yeah, Haley just was like, Dad, what the hell? Like, welcome to the day, back in the day. So, this is cool, actually. This is a nice, this is nice, hey, Mom? Nice piano. Yeah. I know I checked the gramophone out when I, I didn't really check it out. It's an old Brunswick record player, but you spin it. Otherwise, there was no, there was no electricity back in the day. Here's their sports area. Tells all how Roy Romano and all that stuff. A lot of, a lot of actual big Saskatchewan history is in this place. Yeah. Oh, the Haley, you have no idea. Checking like some of this stuff out. This was a big, for a small town, this was, this place was huge when it was incorporated. It's only because it was on the main, main railway. So, like this is the old bank. And you can see how it looked like from the outside. All the old sports equipment. That's kind of funny because like some of this stuff to me is not really that old. <laughs> So, and this is all about some of the professional sports people that have come from here. Some of the professional hockey players. Oh, sorry for the, the fan right there blowing in my... But we got some, some professional hockey players, NHLers, that have been... Oh! Ow! Ow! What did you do? I backed up too far. So, yeah, this is a memorial for the Humboldt Bronco team. 
that a whole bunch of them died in a tragic bus accident a few years back. So, okay. Oh, that hurt the back. Dedicate women of distinction. Neat. Yes, I know I have one of the exactly like this, actually. It's kind of funny that this is antique and yet my mom has mine in her living room. Exactly. It is the same, except for painted. Here's same design. Yeah, it's because they painted it. Here's the flip up side. That's what mine should look like. So, this is cool. I like how they have all the old shutters for the windows. They have just a little bit of a vent. That's neat. I guess it would be for the winter time for like storm windows. This old oven. So, and like I said, this stuff. What, this? No, they never cook babies. I like checking out museums, folks. Yeah. Look at the skates. These are all the skate blades. So you can put, yeah, you can attach these blades to like your normal everyday shoes. And, uh, yeah. That's how it used to be back in the day. A lot of this stuff. A lot, and it's cool because we have a lot of these old containers at home. Like a lot of these old, like we have, I have some of these, you guys have some of these. So, which is neat. So, <laughs> Haley's checking around. We got the, this stuff. Oh yeah, this is all the, yeah, right from the old Union Hospital. Ventilator. Ventilator. For pumping stuff. This is like an iron lung machine almost. Like an early one, apparently. Usage for pumping. See that, guys? In and out, move carbon dioxide from the lungs. Huh. Like, probably for tuberculosis, I bet. I bet you that's for TB. It was a very, very contagious yeah, lung disease back in the day. Yeah, baby oven <laughs> for preemies. So, a doctor's cabinet, the, the jar. And, or is this for embalming? No, that's for dentist. Drugs. Oh, dentist, yeah. Here, I'll zoom that in for you folks. If you guys want to read it. Okay, then I'll zoom out. Oh, people can know to pause to read. They should by now if they've watched YouTube long enough. Yeah. Oh, there's a whole bunch of craziness in here. Oh, this is cool. Old pipes and stuff. Okay. Old flags. Lions Club stuff. What do we got over here? The aerial stuff. Here we go. Dayfo used to have an airport, I guess, where they did military training because you can see people jumping out of airplanes. Let me zoom in for that for you guys. You can pause it to read it if it's not blurry. And they're building airplane engines here too. Crazy. King George Hotel, 1949. Huh. It'd be cool if you could see a build, like this building for, of this place back in the day. Would be neat. Like, of this actual building from the outside from, like, back in the day. Oh, okay. I see. Yeah, if you guys read all that stuff. There was bombings and stuff for tra practicing and training. Okay. Cool. Well, let's, uh, yeah, let's head downstairs now. And, uh. We'll see all they got it's down there. But up here was pretty neat so far. What do you guys think of this, uh, doing this like this? Should this be a separate section of, the, of a separate playlist? Comment down below. I'd love to hear it. All right, downstairs part. Let's uh, check it out. Yeah, I'm going to go this way. It's really echoey in here, too. Who's that? That's probably the queen. Oh. <laughs> so, this is neat.
bird's eye view of Watson. Is that what you grew up sitting in? Uh, yeah, I used to actually have one of these in my bedroom. I did. I don't know ever know what happened to it, but. What would be cool would be if we could see this building somewhere in here. Like, yep. Saxophone. A hundred year old dress. That is cool. The style of that, look at that. That is neat and all hand done. Turn of the century. Violins. <laughs> That's kind of funny, folks. I play a lot of like Red Dead Redemption, and this is seeing this stuff like this is like, oh, it makes me want to go home and play the game. But okay, so I'm guessing around here is where we are for the car show. So, which would be pretty cool. It tells you where everything is now. Okay. Crazy. Sorry, guys, if I'm not saying much. I'm just trying to take it all in. There's a lot here. A lot. Oh, right over there. Hey, well, before we go over here, let's just let's see what's over here. RCMP stuff. What is this? Some crime thing that was happening? Hmm. Crazy. Oh, instruments and stuff. Old. All right. Neat. This is the old safe. For this being the old bank. That's cool. See that? That is old. <laughs> that is an old, old safe. Holy jeez. Organ, and then out here. Yeah, more of the stuff that goes around. Okay. Seeing stuff. Okay, over here. What was the hole? Okay, yeah, I gotta watch out for that. All right, neat, neat. All right, and over here, there's the building we're in right now. That's pretty cool. Oh, yeah, right there. 19, in 1908. Early tractors and machinery on display near the new bank, 1908. So this building's been here. 116 years about? 100, maybe about that? 114 years? Uh, no, according to that, it's like 1908. Yeah. Oh, new bank, right? No. Well, there's people I know. Oh, boy. Oh, from the market. Yeah, more sports stuff for the guys who are downstairs for the display. Yeah, pretty much, yep. Oh. Pretty much, yep. Okay. All right, folks, so that was the museum. Pretty neat to go back in time. We're going to uh, head back, I think, to uh, town now. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. If you 
you know, if you, what do you guys think of the, uh, the, what, the, um, ah, sorry, doing the, uh, museum stuff. Should that be a separate playlist? Sorry. Or should we incorporate it with the, the shows? The, I, so anyways, that is that building. 1908 is what it said. So pretty neat piece of history. So anyways, guys, thank you so much for tuning in. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, all that. We're getting close to a thousand. So yeah, now to head home, edit, because tomorrow I have another video, or another show to go to uh, shoot for you guys. So until then, take care of yourselves. Love you. And from all of us here at Tallows and Turbos, God bless.